Hello, and welcome. I'm Zyndir, and it's been a little while since I uh, made a Feed the Beast episode. Uh, the reasoning why is I got really irritated with it. Why, you ask? Because I had a world-corrupting bug happen to my game. Uh, it was caused by Red Power, and as I'm sure you can tell, I've managed to fix it, but by the time I had fixed it, I was irritated. So, I took a break. Now, and I'd been playing a lot of APB, so... I haven't really uploaded too many videos of that, but I've been playing a lot of APB. But, uh, anyhow, here we are. The modular power armory stuff has added in some new things. I haven't really gotten... I've got all the uh, control circuits, but I haven't made, like, the solar panel. I haven't made it the servos for the auto feeder, but I don't care about that too much at the moment. Same with the servos for the kinetic generator. But as for the control circuits, I'm good ready for that. You can actually color this. I don't know if this has always been here and I just didn't acknowledge it, but... Yeah. And there's a multimeter tool, which I don't think was there. In place assembler. Blink drive. I'm not sure about this, and that kind of scares me. And for some odd reason, I don't remember the key for bringing up the uh, UI for this either. No. No. Okay. There's a lot of random shit in here. What is the. What? See, it's almost like it's not processing the fact that I even have the thing, but whatever. Now, oh, here is the control circuit. It is a pain in the ass to make, but I'm making seven of them. Woohoo! And I've got some force field emitters, I've got a hologram projector, so let's first make the force field emitter which goes on... Oh, I forget what I was making now. Oh yeah, the blink drive. Blink drive energy consumption, one kilojoule. Uh, how does that work? Well, I don't see it over here. Hmm. That's weird. Very, very weird. However, I do want to see this. Flight control module. Oh! I thought, um, when I was reading, they would said they weren't going to implement this, and yeah, you can fly down with Z, but apparently that is, yeah, toggling my mini-map, so I'm going to have to deal with that, but uh, whoa, 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 okay, stop now, is it draining power? Uh-oh. I'm not so sure about that. Uh... M. M does nothing? M, M is not bound to anything, right? M. Mode switch key. Uh... Yeah. I do not know. Okay. I will bind it to the letter H for hover. Cool deal, cool deal. It gives me finer control over that. 
I hope the keybind stays. I don't know if it will or not. Night vision, which apparently is going to need... I don't know if I need to toggle it at the moment, but I don't, as you can see, everything got much brighter. And I can't really... I really should just go down through here and make a comprehensive list of all of the buttons. Charge, toggle, release, pocket crafting table. Oh, uh, apparently that is the create waypoint button as well. That's not helpful. I really should try and use the numpad things, which... I don't know, maybe I can. If I want to make a new key and I want it to be numpad 6, okay, drag him over there. Woo! Okay, that's helpful. And all my waypoints are gone because I also decided to reinstall Windows. I, like, I made that waypoint whenever I was trying to go find some tree. Yeah. Uh, as for the rest of these things, there's a new armor thing. I don't recall this being here, but I don't know what it is. And I don't want to install it because I don't know what it is. Then again, I know that you can use transparent armor with it, so... And I mean, it's not like it costs anything, so I guess I can do that. And I'm being messaged, apparently, on Steam. Probably because I have my mic muted and i on TeamSpeak and whatnot. And, yeah, they do that. Where is... See, some things are missing, because... Oh, this right here, I believe, is transparent armor. I will bind that to a new key, which will be numpad 7. Numpad 7. I th kinda looks like the quantum armor, to be honest. Woo! 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 I don't know. I will leave it off for the moment. And... I have all these control circuits, but... I don't have all the things I need them for, like... Apparently I can use two of them with this and make some kind of solar panel. Yeah, pretty much. But in other news, I redesigned the uh, machine, um, the frame quarry, and I added another level to this. Uh, because... Oh, I lost. I lost! I am lost. There we go. Because I've also increased the size of it. Uh, did, I don't know if that actually completed this. The first time I've tried doing a multiple cycle setup. And... Oh. What? What is with all the red? Is that something that's supposed to be informing where the spawn is this right here was my fault I made a mistake in the setting up the thing but uh, I've moved the layout of the entire thing to pretty much be horizontal and then that gives me pretty much infinite what is the red it's not that it's not that I don't know. I'm assuming it has to do with showing chunk loaders from my... from pressing uh, my record key. I will worry about that later. But uh, I should be able to infinitely expand, and then as I get in the way of these, I can sacrifice a solar panel location and basically charge these off to solar panels. But as it currently stands, like with going five by five like this 
I don't really need the extra power at the moment. And the entire network of machines and stuff can handle themselves. So that's pretty much that with that. Uh, this just leaves me... Oh, I'm going to need to do these, but that shouldn't be too hard with the flight control. See, if those things are chunk loader based, why is there none here? Oh, they're outside. Hmm. Very interesting. And as you can tell, my mountain is still being turned into Swiss cheese by Enderman, which is kind of annoying. I uh, don't need that because it didn't do anything, and I don't need that. So, I'm doing fairly well on materials now. That's quite a bit of tin. So, yeah. This was... I didn't have a whole lot planned, and I don't know if there was really anything hardly else added to... If I go down through the mods... Oh, uh-oh. Scroll down. Uh, there was new stuff added to Zycraft, so you can actually use the crystals for stuff. But uh, I'm going to be honest, I don't know how most of the things are used. Uh, as you can see, there's actually a machine category now. There's valves, and there's item IO, and light engineering brick, which looks fucking expensive, sort of, not really, not really, but then there's like Zycorium soil, and I have no idea what this thing does, it's built with saplings and green engineering bricks, uh, one, two, three, four, oh, what, one, two, three, four, I think you just smelt it, right? That is sulfur. Okay, yeah, that smelts. And then I'm going to need... I have some brick. One, two, three, four. I'm going to need a piece of redstone. And... That gives us greens, a cordite. I have no idea what this does. It might function kind of like a growing thing. Or it might not do fuck all. Who knows? I'll tell you who doesn't know. Me. Uh, no, I already made that. Piece of iron. I forgot that. Okay. Sprint! Damn you. I don't have a whole ton of... I can use these. About time they become useful for something. I don't know if these things need powered. What? What is this? What does it do? Can I plant trees on it? Things I should have looked into previously. Oh, I can. And what does it do? Does it make things grow faster? Or? I don't understand. <sighs> and then there's things like liquid void and fire basin, which I'm assuming just sets things on fire. I'm not sure. And then you got like this iron plate, which apparently doesn't have a recipe. Fabricator. I have no idea. And that's, there's also, it has lights now. If I go to mod, choose iCraft world, uh, there's lights. Which is pretty crazy. I kind of want to use the inverted Zycraft light, but that looks like it's going to take a bit. Why can you make... Oh, right, because technically it's died, so it doesn't... Okay. And then there's 
this, which I'm... See what I said about people in TeamSpeak? This is why you should never have TeamSpeak open. You'd think if you had your sound muted and your mic muted, people would know. But apparently they're dumb. And they don't pay attention. Ugh. So, I'm going to try and think of what I'm going to do. There's cyan. I wish there was like a blue-green, a teal. I guess cyan's the closest thing. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put cyan lights around the outside of this. And then I'm just going to like replace torches as I go. And I'm going to get these filled in with lava probably. But uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to catch up on the mining work that I should have been doing all along. And uh, well, I hadn't changed. I guess it's a good thing I didn't really do anything actually like requiring of sound because I forgot to change my output device. As you can tell by if I do this. You can't really hear that unless it's feeding back through my mic, which I don't think it is. But uh, I'm going to call this good for now. It's just a short episode to give you an update on what exactly happened. So I am going to be getting back into working on things here, and I really want to finish this place. Oh, tree grew already. That was quick. So this is cool. I like this. I might have to look into the Zycraft stuff a bit more now. Um, so this is Zycorium water. I wonder what that does then. I wonder if it just generates a water block. You know what? Let's find out before we stop. One, two, three, four. Ooh, there's a bucket of water in there. I'm going to need to cook up some... I need to make blue engineering bricks. This is kind of a pain. I'm not going to lie. Uh, right. You know what we can do while I'm sitting here waiting and being an idiot? Let's take this crafting table. And if we take said crafting table and go over here and go to my multi-tool, find a control circuit and crafting table, get that. And I'm assuming I have to keybind that. So, numpad 8. No, 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 no. Hmm. Hmm. No. That's the flight control. Okay, I see. Sort of. Still missing some creatures. Sorry, creatures. Yeah, I don't see the pocket crafting table. How do I... What is this? I don't even. A larger crafting grid on the go. Hmm. No. B? B? C? No. No. Oop. Oh. No. The hell? I have no idea what Y is toggling. God damn it. How many times am I going to press that? And that? I have no idea how one brings up said crafting table. Don't know. I really don't know. I'm going to have to look into these things a bit. And this should allow me to generate power by sprinting. And this should allow me to... This is an auto-feeder. That's pretty simple. 
and what I can I can actually use a canning machine, which I think the cans are recyclable, so I can make infinite food out of rotten flesh. Be a bit of a pain in the ass, but if the auto feeder works with it, it'd be nice. Which I would assume it would work with canned meat because it has the industrial craft compatible recipes. So that's that with that. And I'm gonna probably I wanna get the storage room designed up. Which I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this. I'll think about that. And I'm not gonna lie, basalt and marble is overused all holy hell, but meh. Everybody uses it. Oop. And I also have my mouse sensitivity set stupidiculously high in my mouse software, so yeah. What was I doing? I just oh, right. Sidetracked by trying to figure out that stupid thing. Let's make oh, engineering bricks. Brick, brick, brick. Oh, what did I do with the redstone? I put it away, didn't I? I just wanted I had a piece of redstone. Did I not have a piece of redstone? I probably put it back on there. Like a dumbass. Okay, so. Blue engineering brick. I'm going to assume this consumes my bucket. Oh no, no, I actually got the bucket back. Hmm. So this is Zycorium water, but that makes me wonder. I don't know. Oh, I bet it goes along with these. And you'd have to attach it in order to be able to grow things that you normally couldn't grow. So, let's take wheat. So then I'm assuming what the Zycorium water does, it allows you to have a... Basically a water source for these things. If that makes sense. I'm just speculating. I'll look this up for the next time around. And then there's not a whole lot else at the moment. These bricks look like they'd probably look really cool though. And I'm not sh You know what? Screw it. We're already doing things. What do I have the most of? Blue and white, but mostly blue. Okay, so we'll cook up some blue. It's any color of engineering brick. We're going to need a piece of iron. We're also going to need a crafting table. I don't have any wood. You know. I really should have put it in the furnace before I started this. Oh, not you. You. Okay, so... Bricks. One, two, three, four. Uh, fabricator, smooth stone. Three of it. One, two, three. Ah! Okay. Va oh. Okay, that goes there. I haven't, by the way, I haven't done anything with 1.5 yet. Like, this is still on 1.46 or 1.47 because that's how it works. So, I haven't done anything with, uh, well, it's growing kind of quickly, too, actually. Hmm. Very interesting. I like. 
Fabricator. Whoa! The fuck is this? This might be a little bit too advanced for me. I'm gonna have to look that up. This looks cool, and I'm gonna go place it somewhere. Right there. Woo! Just so I can stare at it. it. Looks awesome. I think I'm going to do a checker pattern floor in here with Zycraft blocks. But I'm gonna do it with cyan and black. So dark and. Well, it, I don't think it really matters. I can use whichever color I want to use the least of to do it. I should probably just use a bunch of blue. Maybe. Maybe I should save the blue. Oh no, the fabricator doesn't... See? Imagining things. And what is Zycorium ice? Does that just turn water around it into ice? That would actually make sense. And I'm not sure about the Zycorium void... I will look into these things for next time, but I believe I've already figured out just by experimenting what the water and the soil does. So... The fuck? I don't know what that is, but it apparently does not work. I have a feeling there's going to be more things coming to the modular power suit thing. I never... Or I did install the blink drive, didn't I? What the fuck? Sorry, I was just sitting here and I realized I installed a blink drive, did I not? Hmm. Blink. Blink? Hello? Ooh. Hmm. I have no idea. That's the short version of that story. So, I'm going to call this good for now. I'm going to look into the Zycorium uh, stuff. I'm going to look into modular power suits and why my plasma thingy, my tool, doesn't work. And, yeah. That's what I'll start off with next time. As well as probably trying to design a farm and maybe an auto crafting system around these. It's a really cool system, though. I like that. So, uh, I'm going to call this good, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.